morning all. Good morning. Good morning, Good morning Honorable Sunday. Good morning, Honorable Members. Good morning, Chairperson. Good morning, colleagues. Uh, Jamu, morning. can you morning, Chair. Good morning. The agenda? Yes, good morning to everyone. Uh, now the time is nine o'clock. Uh, good morning, the Secretariat. Can you flight the agenda on the screen? Honorable members, good morning. Uh, I do welcome you all in this meeting today. Uh, I'm aware that most of the provinces we are having to welcome you all for this meeting problems. today, but we must try our best. Uh, I'm suspecting all of us were a little bit happier about uh, what our paramedics, para, what is this name? The Paralympics. 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 Paralympics, yes, which they are doing very well. Uh, I'm yes. suspecting the South Africans are, are rejoicing. Uh, I'm, I, I'm suspecting this is the first time of us to get uh, medals like that. So uh, we, are, we do congratulate them and as individuals, as collective. Also, uh, we are in this meeting today on our last day uh, of uh, our day as women, as mothers, and as wives, sisters, uh, with a ending with so many uh, pathetic things which are happening. Sometimes we'll always uh, wanting that our fathers, our, our brothers, our husband can, can tell us what have we done as mothers whom we've uh, brought them in this earth, nine months in our wombs, but they do have guts uh, to chop and kill us, to burn us. And seemingly honorable members, Every of this month, whilst it's 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 30, 365 days, we are faced with this. But during our month, uh, maybe uh, we cannot not to call it our month. The brutality that uh, some of men, some of boys are doing to us is very pathetic. I'll never ever think that. There's somebody called your lover that can chop you into pieces, let alone uh, even to burn you. Uh, I'm suspecting next month we're getting to the month of uh, Amaku culture, cultural uh, month. Um, our, our own uh, men, our own traditional uh, leaders must try. Uh, to teach these young boys, but also it does that at home, let alone that government is trying, but uh, this is very pathetic. Um, by those words, I'm saying that COVID-19 uh, is one of a, a, a pandemic which is um, vicious, but I, I can't believe that the second epidemic of gender-based violence, it's so uh, vicious. Uh, it's it's competing with this COVID-19. Uh, those who have not yet taken their jab, uh, through your willingness, you go and do likewise. Uh, as you know that it's upon you, and and you are not being forced. Uh, I'm taking this opportunity also to welcome uh, our uh, department, uh, to welcome 
the visitors see sir, a leadership. I don't know who's here. They will introduce themselves. And, uh, and as I'm doing this, uh, I'm looking at the time that I was given. I'll, I'll ask the, the administrators to give us the apologies in this meeting of today. We are all welcome. <laughs> Chabu. Honorable members, I, I, according to myself, I know that the minister, uh, what are you doing, Chabu? Forwarded the apology uh, and then if possible, it, it can chip in and rush to this meeting, but the apology has been forwarded. The deputy minister is with us today. I, I don't know any other apology because I was yeah. just waiting for, for the, for the uh, secretariat to give us apologies. I don't know, uh, they were just quiet. Uh, good morning members, good morning chair. We have received the apology from the minister. We also have received an apology from uh, Mr. Madlingwazi, he's taken ill. And we've also received an apology from Dados BC. He has a family bereavement chair. Those three apologies that we've received today, chair. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, our condolences to uh, Honorable CBC. Uh, I did speak to Honorable Madlingwazi. I was thinking that uh, he has recovered. Uh, uh, but uh, now uh, speedily recovery, uh, Honorable Matlingosi. Uh, thank you so much, Honorable Members. Uh, this is agenda in front of us, uh, a proposed agenda. And if there's nothing that you want to change, I will ask members to adopt the agenda. Anyone? Mama Bolo. What are you saying, Mama Bolo? We are saying no, no, Mama it, Bolo. no, no, it looks good to me. Uh, I'm moving for the adoption. Thank you so much, Honorable Mama Bolo. Any second? Chairperson, Honorable Adams. Yes. Honorable Adams. Thank you. Thank you, Honorable uh, Adams. Any other uh, objection of the agenda, which is already adopted? The agenda has been adopted. Uh, honorable members, uh, let me now also uh, give the platform according to uh, our agenda uh, that the department must give us a overview on cultural and creative industries, Federation of South Africa. Uh, I don't know who's here because I didn't give them time to introduce when everyone is trying to uh, in, introduce, to do overview, they will, they will introduce themselves. But I know that the department Today is led by the Deputy Minister, uh, Honorable Notsawe Mafo Unonzaba. Uh, we are going to uh, this month tomorrow. Uh, we need to know our clan names as Marlon DM uh, Nonzaba. Thank you very much, uh, Chair of the Portfolio Committee, Marlon. And uh, greetings to the members of the Portfolio Committee. And, uh, and the officials from the department led by the, the DG, also the, the team coming from the, uh, the, the Cultural Creative uh, Industry, Federation Industries of South Africa. We, we are here, Chair, at your request to come and present uh, to you uh, about CIFSA 
the DG will do the overview and then we, we will get to the presentation. What I want to do is not to waste your time so that we get to the nuts and bolts of the presentations. And then I will come at the end of the presentation to do my closing remarks. And, and thank you very much. Thank you very much, Deputy Minister. Uh, DJ. Uh, good morning, uh, Honorable Chairperson, uh, Honorable Members of the Distinguished uh, Portfolio Committee of the Department of Sport, Arts and Culture, the leadership of CIFSA, led by the President of CIFSA, Ms. Mbewan, uh, my colleagues in the department, and uh, from my side, my Deputy Minister as a leader of our team. Um, I am Vusim Kize, the Director General. I have uh, only the apology of one DDG, um, uh, Madam Khan. However, the other DDGs are here. Uh, Mr. Ndema will uh, uh, request that he be excused at some point due to some other matters he needs to attend to. But uh, I would request Chairperson, in light of uh, avoiding uh, fault lines with uh, Babu Mshomo, Jomani, that they introduce themselves uh, so that the, the photos can be seen, uh, so that we have to go on the Zobonu Thai, and we have to go on the Morocco, and we have to go on the Chad, we have to go on the Good morning, Honorable Chairperson, uh, the Deputy Minister, uh, all the honorable members of the committee, my name is Busitem Bandima, DDG responsible for heritage promotion and preservation. Thank you. DDG Kumalo. Sorry, I'm talking, I, I didn't realize I have not unmuted. Um, good morning, um, Honorable Chairperson, Honorable Members, uh, Deputy Minister DG and my colleagues. My name is um, Dr. Stella Kumalo. I am the DDG for Arts, Culture, Promotion and Development. Thank you. Thanks, DDG and uh, Chikwadamba. Maybe let's move to Chief of Staff, Mr. Lo. Mo morning, min <laughs> I just said morning, Minister. Uh, morning, uh, Chairperson. Morning, uh, Honorable Members, uh, Deputy Minister, and all my colleagues. My name is JP Lo, and I am Chief of Staff in Sports, Arts, and Culture. Thank you. <clears throat> Uh, I'm coming back, DJ. I realized uh, my greeting was not heard. I am Mandisa Chikwatamba. I'm the head of corporate services, DDG for corporate services. Um, sorry about the first attempt. I don't know what went wrong with my mic. Thank you. Thanks, sir. Can I ask Lulama? Thank you, DJ. Good morning, honorable members, uh, deputy minister, and Colleagues, um, my name is Lula Amanda Bangulu from the office of the DG. Thank you. Um, I think uh, that is uh, the team I have, uh, Honorable Chairperson, and maybe our special greeting to uh, Baba KB on Pato. Yeah, thanks very much. And for the chair? Uh, and, uh, you know, DG. Sorry, Honorable Mshongo, you are reminding me, I've just forgotten that I needed to tell Honorable Members that we are having a new member uh, in the committee, not new member in parliament. Uh, Honorable K. Bima Paso joined us in this committee from another committee. I'm very sorry, you know, when you, you know that uh, there were changes. And then I was supposed uh, from the very onset uh, to introduce Honorable KB Mapazo 
can you greet us, Honorable KB? I'm very sorry. Is Honorable KB Mapaso in, in a meeting? Jabu, is Honorable KB in the meeting today? No, no, Chair, we haven't seen him in the meeting yet, Chair. Okay. Uh, Honorable Mshong? Honorable Mshong, yes. Thank you, Chairperson. I think uh, I'm calling to order UDG. He doesn't know his clan name. Kabazela, because you ruled that today when we introduce ourselves, we must have our claim name. DG, you don't know your claim name and even your colleagues. Thank you, Che. I think we must take your ruling seriously. Thank you. Jomane, Jomane. Kabazela. From tomorrow, uh, tomorrow. It's a so good thing. And no, tomorrow we're not having a meeting. No, tomorrow. As this committee, we do understand and know that tomorrow is the day. Uh, so Umar Lomo is saying, everyone must think that uh, we are going to welcome the 1st of September as our, our day, as this Arts and Culture uh, Committee. Uh, thank you, Joman. No, it, was, it, was in the interest, uh, it was in the interest of social cohesion because <laughs> I'm not sure uh, how will uh, Honorable Fandik have uh, uh, it Tagaze. So it's just to be accommodative as, as part of my duties uh, in German. Good morning, Okabaze. Nkize Gamavo. You must not think that there are those who doesn't have clean uh, names. Don't, uh, we must not enter in that. Uh, go on, Digi. Uh, 